You put a bag of Doritos on Dan's grave? Are you f***ing kidding me? Dan liked Doritos. It was his munchie snack. Dan doesn't have the munchies. Dan is dead. He could have the munchies if he was a zombie. <laughs> that's, that's one of those things I, I should probably keep to myself. You think? If anyone would have died from texting while driving, I would have figured it was you. What? I mean, at least we never have to deal with any curses again. <laughs> yeah, never have to deal with another curse again. You know when you said never to mess with dark forces? Wendell, what did you do? <laughs> Siri, how do you make a pentagram? Who dares summon me? I may not have listened. You tried resurrecting Dan by summoning the Grim Reaper. Actually, I prefer death. Grim Reaper is way too formal, man. Forgive me. Get the feeling that you're mad at me? Really? What did I tell you about rituals? To avoid them, especially if they involve sex or symbols. Exactly. I didn't have sex. I did not have voice. You're a dipshit. Okay, so what do we do now? Death? Oh, yeah. Gotcha, bro. Okay, so my boy Wendell here wants to bring your buddy back from the dead. That's easier said than. Done? Oh, yeah, I forgot I was talking. Um, so, yeah. First of all, your bro needs a new body. He's like, been, been dead way too long. Two, since he was attached to that cursed bro, cursed bro needs a new body too. Third of all, third of all, if you bring people back, make them a magnet for some pretty up shit. <laughs> That's okay. That shit happens to us all the time anyway. So, you gonna do this first? Okay, well, I think we should stop thinking about this. Wendell! Sweet. Wendell? Wendell! Mm, what? There's this, there's this girl standing in the room. Um, did you see where this like cloaky dude went? Goes by the name of Dip? Probably not the best thing to worry about right now. Oh shit! What? I forgot to send my DVR to Pretty Little Liars. I mean, football. 
Okay, can we focus on this? Okay. Uh, Zoe, I'm scared. Mm -hmm. We should probably start running now. Ow. That hurt. Zoe. I think I peed a little. Ew. I'm a little turned on. Did you have like head trauma as a child? Maybe. Why? Reasons you wouldn't understand. I feel like you're insulting me, but I don't understand enough to know for sure. Okay, we need to go find death before we get killed. That sounded really f weird. gonna help us with our demon girl issue. What are you talking about, bro? There's a demon bitch trying to attack us back in the room. Oh yeah, it's scary. Like, a cool too scary. <laughs> what? That was not a demon, that was Dan. Uh, that was Dan. You turned him into a girl. Why? I thought it was funny at the time. I thought it was funny. Are you <laughs> kidding me? It's kind of funny. You think about it. Thinking. That's a new one for you. I'm oh, sorry you woke up on the grumpy side of the bed. Is it morning? I really don't have humor in the land where you grew up with Scrooge ass McGrumpy faces. Yeah, I did. We also didn't believe in playing with dark forces. Can't say that about you. Haha, <laughs> burn. She got you, bro. You! D do you even know anything about the body you put him in? Is it healthy? She's right. They might have like autistic fibrosis or something like that. Cystic fibrosis. That too. What? What do we do about them? Oh, I have an idea. Awesome, bro. It's not in well. That's your role plan. A bag of f***ing Doritos. That's not the entire plan. Oh, what's the rest of it? The trail of Doritos leading up to it. I swear to God, my ring feels like one minute, so excuse me. No, it isn't. Can you not eat the Doritos? 
I'd rather go. I'm sorry, but as death, don't you have like souls to collect or some shit? Not really. Everything's pretty automatic. I spend most of my day with Netflix. Awesome, it sounds like a rap song. Netflix and bongs. Netflix and bongs. Netflix and bongs. Me and Death making a rap song. Netflix and bongs. Netflix and bongs. Zoe's getting pissed, so we probably better stop. Are we supposed to see us she probably can he can she can he can he can okay huh. <gasps> did you see what happened on screen the tv series no i have more important things to worry about what do i tell you about that show it's for hipsters and douchebags F***ing right bros it's your bro <gasps> Seriously, why does this dumb shit always work? <laughs> I'm, I'm done, seriously. I'm done doing the normal smart thing. What? Okay, I'm just worried about my personal breakdown. Like, Why are you thinking you should, like, get them now? Okay. Finished, bros. Your bros as good as new. Memory's all back. <sighs> I'm exhausted. But all you do is tap it on the forehead. Of course you only tap it on the forehead, because only stupid shit works. <laughs> what the f***? What the hell happened? What the f***? Why do I have boobs? What the f***? Uh, yeah. It's Wendell. Okay, don't freak out. We kind of got in the fiery crash a little bit, but it's okay. We brought you back in a girl's body with lady parts. You're welcome. What the f I miss my penis. And it misses you. Don't patronize me. I didn't say anything about America. That's not what patronizing means. Yes it is. Zoe, back me up. Back yourself up. You checked out. What's wrong with you? Well, Zoe's having what we call a personal crisis. That seems out of the blue. Ah, uh, she'll be fine by the next episode. Episode? A pretty little liars. I mean, Grey's Anatomy? Not a better cover-up. Uh, Can we help you? What's up, bros? Seth! Why do you look that way? I'm incognito, bro. Figured I'd need to be if I'm gonna be hanging out with my new, my new homie. Awesome! Right, so let me recap of what happened last week. 
I'm trapped in a girl's body, Zoe has lost her mind, Wendell is playing with dark forces that makes me a magnet for evil, and death has become our new friend. F***ing great. This is f***ing stupid. There's one more little thing, bro. Oh god. What? Okay, it's a stuffed Einstein. Insolent peasant! How dare you label me in such a childish manner? Dye your hair again. Just from your little personal crisis. My hair is is your focus right now. Dan's dead again. Yeah. But I mean, it's, it's not like it's, it's my fault. You talked to the Grim Reaper, who's a pothead. Didn't even check if the body was healthy that he brought Dan back in. Yeah, I know. He died from autistic fibrosis. I told you. He died from a heart attack. Yeah. 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 Let's just not do that again. Maybe we should just accept it this time. Move on. Um, uh, I may have talked to death a little bit again. Really, Wendell? A girl's body? Again? No, autistic fibrosis. No, autistic fibrosis. Or oh, not, not fiber. Not fiber. What is fiber? Uh, Siri, show me images of what fiber does. Uh, 